Justice League, the anime series, season 2, episode 7, 8, titled Maid of Honor. And the story is basically about is someone in powers has been attempted kidnapping uh, a king's daughter. And because of that, Batman and Wonder Woman are investigating over who is trying to take away the princess. I really enjoy these two episodes. I really do. And what I really like is at definitely the first half of seeing like Batman or Wonder Woman investigating the attempted kidnapping in their own way. I mean Batman's whole thing is, you know, he's like Sherlock Holmes. His name is one of his names is the world's greatest detective. He's like smoothing around, he's you know, Sherlock Holmesing all the time. But he's also like the Dark Knight, so he's, so he's interrogating people, going into the shadows, or you have Wonder Woman Who's basically the whole thing is just like going to walk up to the princess and, and hang hang around with her and talk to her and see if there's anyone in her life that might hurt her. And I feel like those two different like ways of doing things. And I, I found that really cool to, to see. And I kind of, I mean, I really love the Batman moment where in like the first half where like there's this guy, this henchman, this thug, this punk that Batman has knocked over and trying to get information but because they're in powers this guy only speaks French and he says in French you know you're the you know you you don't share my tongue you don't speak French so I'm not going to tell you even if you do no I'm not even going to tell you at all ever and then Batman goes and does his serious voice and says like I do and you will and I'm like oh my god oh my god this is gonna be awesome and of course we don't see it because you know Batman can't break a thousand legs and all that kind of stuff as he is normally do does in the comics he can't do that kind of stuff for a like a Saturday morning cartoon um I love how the princess doesn't care that she almost got kidnapped like she doesn't care she's like oh hang around in I'll go do shopping and run away from my bodyguards and do this and do that and go to night clubbing and but I with my new friend Wonder Woman and it's like it's 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 that kind of like generic that's that's entertainment at through and it definitely but when the main plot happens you know when we find out who's responsible and the main plot and you know the the villain's plan and stuff I don't want to hit the spoilers but it's really it's really cool it's the most it's like any time that um, was it uh, Dwayne but Duffy um, writes a story, it's the most entertaining action of all of the show, really, because he clearly he had a cinematic view. Yeah, he had a like a way to tell cinematic action scenes in a live in a um in a 20 minute time frame in a you know 2d animation and also it's so awesome to hear like the wedding theme at you know the da 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 one little woman is getting it's it's fighting you know the villains planes along with Batman do 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 one woman is picking up a tree and chucking at people like hearing seeing that with the dirt yeah you know, that is like wow that is cinematic to its core one of the things I don't want to get to point it's just a hell of fun it's just a hell of fun just may it honor watch it you know watch both episodes and you will have a fun time